Hi, Jeff Cote with Pacific Yacht Systems. This next video is about how do you go about installing a battery box for flooded lead acid batteries on your boat, or even an AGM if you decide to actually put it in a container like this. The first thing you've got to realize is that, especially when you're installing a flooded lead acid battery, the battery box is not only a device that holds your battery from actually moving sideways or if your case your boat is inverted from actually falling down or just it's not securing just your battery it's actually also meant to secure any electrolyte that might come out of the battery and oddly enough when i do electrical audits and i've done probably thousands already i would say that over a third or 40 percent of the boats that i walk on have actually electric light in the bottom of the battery box and what's actually so sad and disappointing is that a lot of people, when they see this battery box and they go, they purchase this, there's no manual with this battery box. So what do people do? They look at this and they're like, well, how am I going to stop it from moving? They actually drill four holes in the corners from inside the battery box and literally just simply screw it from the inside down onto a floor on their boat. Nothing could be worse. You defeat the whole purpose of this battery box. The battery box is a container first and foremost. So when we tackle projects and we're installing a battery box like this on a boat, we keep the container intact. That means no holes in the bottom. And so what we do when we install a battery box like this, we'll actually install aluminum L brackets like this all around the battery box. That will stop the battery from battery box from moving laterally. And then what we'll end up doing is we've installed these pad eyes. We'll put them on either side of the box. And then we'll use this really beefed up battery strap and we're going to cinch that battery box down. And now that's a perfect battery box installation because the battery cannot move. It's got a container for the electrolyte. So if there's any spillage, overfilling of the battery box, overcharging of the battery, the electrolyte is going to stay within the box. And in case, God forbid, you ever have a knockdown on a sailboat or really, really heavy seas, this battery strap these beefy pad eyes, these angled aluminum L brackets are gonna hold the battery in place so you just don't have to worry about these heavy batteries moving about on your boat. That's really important. Thanks for watching.